All right, I'm pissed, I'm exhausted, I'm annoyed, and I'm just overall, I just don't feel good. And there's so many factors that come to it that I'm just gonna pick certain things to talk about because I really need to get this out of my system because if I don't get this out of my system, I'm gonna blow the fuck up. So, um, first of all, um, I, was, I took a nap. I came back from school, I took a nap, and I literally just woke up, and it's like 11. And I know that's a long nap, but I'm tired, and I'm still tired, and I'm just, I can never catch up on sleep, and it's so annoying. But uh, I'm trying to do this eye treatment under eye pad thing, so my eyes are not like, you know, it doesn't show that I haven't been sleeping. Like, I've just been doing things, but it's just, I'm just so disgusted at this point. So, the first thing I want to talk about is, I guess you can even say this is a rant, but the first thing I want to talk about is um, Student Union. So, Student Union is basically, if you don't know what it is, um, I don't blame you, because I didn't know what the fuck it was for, at first, when I first heard of it. So, the first thing, I, so first, it's a... Uh, it's like an organization in a, in my school where students, where a group of students select students, um, talk about what they can do for the school, of what events they can make for the school, what things can change, what they shouldn't be doing at the school, just make fun stuff for the school and um, represent the students' opinions on what they want to do. It's basically like student council, like, I don't know what they call it in USA, but like, I, I feel like you get the gist of what I'm trying to say. So, I joined it because um, I felt like my first year in my high school, I feel like there was just by the uh, people around, like people that I know, like, whenever there's an event, they complain about certain things. They're like, oh, my God, they don't represent su such and such people as well. These events are so lame and such and such. So the only reason why I joined this was because I wanted to voice my opinion because I agree with them. Like, half the stuff that we do in school, it sucks. It really does. And I don't want my year to suck. I want it to be the most fun, the most funnest productive year ever and honestly i just love stuff like that i always been into those type of things it's just always been in my blood to do stuff like that um and be leadership and do stuff like that like i don't have friends who are really into that and that's okay my friends don't have to be in it into it but that's my thing so the thing about it that's annoying me is i'm not bald by the way i, I gotta sleep but I had to keep doing it because I, I'm i so tired to the point where I can't even be creative with my hair no more. But the thing I want to talk about was SU because I'm just so annoyed. I'm absolutely uh, disgusted by how my team treats other people in that group. And I feel like no one talks about it. And I'm just like... You guys are just gonna brush this away like it's not a big deal. Like if a team is not willing to work together and um, um, try to see what's going on in people's lives, not in lives, but make sure everyone's doing good and you're just gonna boss people around, especially the president. I'm sorry if you're watching this, I'm not gonna say any names, but like you need to get it together. I'm tired of you trying to boss people around i know it's your job but like you need to be more considerate of people's feelings and like try to be more inclusive of everyone's opinions because at this point i don't even want to talk like i feel like i have no voice whenever i say something people just brush it off like if you guys are just going to give basic ideas to the point where it's so basic and then when you do the event, it's like whack. Like, no one even comes. Like, I tell, I give an idea and then people, are, they just like, ignore me. And like, when I say something so brutally, very honest, they think I'm just giving this black girl trait. And it's like, no, like, this is what the school needs. Like, what you guys are doing is like, not what the school wants. <sighs> Anyways, um, and today I was 
today they, the event, there, were, there was a pumpkin contest carving thing, and the teachers had to carve stuff and all that. And, you know, of course, people have to announce them the, the event and, you know, guide people what's going on and telling them what's happening. And all of a sudden, they're like, oh, yeah, Gail, um and my partner, he was like, you guys are going to be the MCs. I'm just like... That was out of nowhere. Like, you guys didn't give me no heads up. Everybody apparently knew because there's a script written for us already. They sent me the script last minute. I looked through the script, and, like, it's a bunch of teachers' names that I don't even know how to pronounce. And, like, I literally embarrassed myself. And, like, there's this one Asian kid who's so freaking annoying. I swear to God, I'll slap the shit out of him if he doesn't stop. Like, he grabs the microphone from me and gives him back, gives it back to my partner while I was speaking. Like, while I was about to speak. Like, what? Like, that just shows the disrespect. Like, if you don't like me speaking, you don't have to listen. Like, don't just come out of nowhere, embarrass me, grab the microphone, and give it to the next person. Like, that is so embarrassing. Alright. That's the one thing that's pissing me off. Because I feel like I'm just wasting my time. Like, I am so busy. Like, I have so many things to study for, so many exams. I work, and then I have YouTube youtube to do like i love youtube videos it's not a job to me but you know i have to find time to do it and for me to waste my time with these people to the point where they're not even considering my feelings and how i feel about it it's like what the fuck am i even here for like why am i doing this it's like a waste of my time and i feel like i should just drop it and it's just so embarrassing because people you know i know people look at me they're like why is this one black girl in this thing? Like, what is she doing? Like, there's another black girl. I'm not concerning him, but... Like, I just want to be representative to my school and, like, help it be better, I guess. And, like, I don't even know why I care so much, but I think it's just always been me. Like, I always wanted... Like, anywhere I am, where I am is... I wanted for it to be better, and... Since I came into high school, I said, you know, I'm not making no friends. Like, I don't want to make friends with these people because people are so freaking big. Because people don't care about other people. I don't even know why I'm crying. Like, people don't care about each other. People are here just here to make shit, talk shit, and make people feel humiliated. humiliated. Um, so I have leadership, and I'm not going to describe what it is. Just by the word leadership you probably should know what it is but there's i don't have friends in that that much i have one friend and she you know she's busy most of the time she doesn't come but i don't have friends in that thing and i try to make friends but it's like no one i have nothing in common and like they already have their own groups and i don't want to just like come in like oh hey you know let's just be friends like that's just so awkward and then whenever, whenever I say something, like, they, they can't, you know, relate. Because it's just, like, we're just so different. And I just don't know how to make friends like that. Like, I'm just so used to having just a small group of people in my life where I, I don't know how to branch out no more. Because I'm just so closed in. And I just, I don't feel safe just making new friends like that. And it's hard because it's hard. It's I'm, I'm starting to see why it's, you know, it's necessary to try to be more friendly. And I am friendly, it's just, I just don't know how, know how to open up anymore. And it's so weird because I don't, I'm not like that. I used to never be like that. I used to be the one making conversations, saying, what's up, how you doing? So I used to be that one first person to come up to you and be friends. But now I don't do, I don't do that no more. And I don't, I don't know if it's because I'm shy or I'm scared. I don't know. And, um, this one girl, you know, she keeps giving me these looks, and I'm just like, what, what did I do to her? And, you know, um, I, ju I just don't know what I did to her, and she's in leadership, and, you know, I'm trying to be friends with her and stuff, but, like, she just, like, keeps throwing shady jobs at me, and it's like, what did I do to you? And I get it, not everyone's gonna like you, but there's literally no reason for you to be doing this, like, I don't understand. You're probably like, what are you talking about? I'm sorry. Like, I could just... <sighs> There's so many other things I want to talk about, but I don't want this video to be so long, too long, because I'm just out of it. 
I am just so out of it. And I am disappointed by the choices the choices I made this week. I'm not going to talk about it right now. I'll mention it in the next video or something like that because it's too early for me to talk about it. But I am just, I just feel left out and stupid and like I feel like I'm in the wrong spot. I'm in the wrong group of people. <laughs> but it's my thing. Like, I like this type of stuff. But the people in it is making me hate it. It's making me want to drop everything and just go to school, go to work, and that's it. Like, I don't want to be part of my school no more. I don't want to do stuff like that. And when I'm not part of it, when I'm not part of the behind the scenes, I don't feel good. I feel like... I could have done something about this, you know? Like, I could have said something, and maybe that could have changed, but people are not considering my opinions, and I don't know why. I really don't know why. And and like, and like, if I do stay, stay quiet, they're going to be like, why am I here? Like, why are you actually here for? And if I'm, you know, I'm, I'm too much, I'm too this, I'm like, oh, Oh, black girl is here. Shit, what's going on? You know, like, I just can't. I just feel so dumb. Like, you know, I don't know how to describe it, but it's, it's, it's hard to try to be nice to people without feeling like you're being used. Like, I don't want to be friendly to the point where people, like, are going to use me. And, like, you think I'm stupid and you think you can just do whatever you want to me. I want to be, I just want to be, like, serious. And, like, I can't be serious because, you know, there's stereotypes about black people already, black girls in particularly. And I don't want to be that aggressive person. Like, sometimes people need that aggressiveness so they can stop fucking with me like I swear to god like people just don't understand and um I just can't really honestly I just don't even know what to say because leadership was meant and SU was meant to be fun you know, these things these things were meant to be fun it's been 15 minutes I should take this out it's meant to be fun and we got people not including people anymore making people feel like and i don't like that i don't have any more water but i just don't like it at all i don't know if i should drop it or not i don't know but i i just don't feel like i'm i fit in it like I thought I would be. I don't think I fit. I don't think I'll ever fit. No matter how much I try to be friends and friendly. And whenever I'm not, whenever I'm too friendly, I don't feel good either. And it just brings me back memories when I was in the elementary because, you know, I just, I was always so clueless and like, <sighs> clueless and like, I would be so nice to the point where people like, take advantage of my me being nice and I was like to myself you know I'm never gonna be like that like I'm going to not be as serious but like be to myself and I can see how it's like not working it's not working for me I don't even know why I'm crying about this like it shouldn't be hurting me I didn't I didn't even think this hurt me so much but let me tell you an example of what happened. So, um, the president, I'm not here to blame people, but she had to make groups because, you know, they're on, most of them are in grade 12, and um, they're going to leave. See so, ya. Yeah. Like, I really don't like them. <laughs> and, um, 
she has to start making us prepared because I'm in grade 11. They have to prepare us to be able to continue SU. And for that to happen, we have to be aware and ready to take responsibility of most events. And you know, there's other grade 11s in that group, of course. And we, she has to pick roles of different people. Tell me why. I'm not here to make things about race. But when you see it, you can't brush it away. Tell me why. Me, me, my friend. You know, she, like I said, she's usually busy. So, like, she's always in SU, though. Like she, me, my friend. Um, she makes the group. She's announcing the names. She says, this name, that name, this name, great. Fine. I don't hear my name. I don't hear Gael. I don't hear my friend's name. Do I not have a group? Like, so then people are like, wait, what about them two? And then they're like, oh, and she's like, oh yeah, are you guys in grade 12 or something? They're like, bitch, shut the fuck with your fake ass. You're fake. You're fake. You're fake. You are, how do you not? I. It's been like, a good two months my nigga two months how the fuck do you not know i'm in, in grade 12 i may not look like it i'm sorry but I'm pre i know for a fact she knew i was in grade 11 because there are certain things that i'm not able to do when i'm in grade 12 in that group she purposely and it's not even a coincidence because my friend is black too she didn't was well, she wasn't picked to be in a group why why do you why did you not make a group for us let me know let me know because i do you not see me be capable of doing it you know what let me stop let me stop i just like i said i don't know if i should drop it if i should continue if i just just go because things shouldn't be the way it is and last year when i was in student union i mean student council in junior high it wasn't like that it was so fun like i was excited to do it and like we were making fans and people were like oh my god this is awesome and stuff you know it's great and like it's good to hear good feedback from people about what you was part of what you did but now i feel like it's a drag like i just don't feel like i fit in and you know, it's just weird. And I know there's people, there's people in that group who try to make me feel inclusive. And I appreciate them so much for that. But there's people in that group that if they don't stop, they're going to get a smack. <laughs> and I'm going to show them a real stereotype of a black girl. For real. Because I don't play. I really don't. But I didn't think this hurt me that much i didn't think it bothered me that much but i guess it did but like i said if i didn't do this i was gonna snap on one of them tomorrow or next week or next month or whenever i was gonna snap it wouldn't be pretty but like i said um i'm just talking i don't know what i'm gonna do yet but hopefully it's a good choice I don't know what I'm doing. I don't know what I'm doing. And on and also this, this is not the only thing that's bothering me, but I really wanted to go a full into depth talking about this. And it's not just necessarily about SSU and like leadership. It's like overall in general how people treat me and see me as and make me feel. And I don't wanna be too friendly. I really don't. I don't owe anybody any owe anybody anything, but I feel like people have this image of you, and it's not always positive. And when you're not a positive person, when you're not like when you're not like. If you're not like that, you're going to have an image of you. It's never positive. It's never positive. And I know I'm never smiling, but like I know they use this thing on me 
to be like, you know what, you're not, I don't think you're quite fit for this because of how you deal with people. I'm sorry if I'm not friends with y'all. I'm sorry if I'm not, like, friendly, but, like, y'all don't, you guys don't deserve it, so. Yeah, um, that's all I'm gonna say in this video. I'm done. Thanks for watching. I'm sorry, this was really long. I didn't think it was gonna be that long, but it was necessary. I'm gonna go finish my assignments. I stay up for a little bit. Even if I'm tired, it is what it is. It's gonna pay off, hopefully. Something is also on my chest, but I'm not ready to talk about it yet. I'll wait for a little bit and see how things go. And I'll tell you what's happening after. But thanks for watching. And I'll see you guys on my next video.